Christians are. We live in the world, yes. but we're not supposed to be of the world. Right. So how do you balance that? Well, see, you be the, who you are no matter where you go. Exactly. You, and that's exactly what you've done. Because you ladies look, you, you, you look very lovely today. And my husband, I'll, I'll just say Don't miss it. And my husband <laughs> likes that. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, that's what people don't understand. Like, yeah. we're supposed to be running around with some nun uniforms on. Like, we're, no. not, we're not nuns. No, you know I, mean, I mean? No slight to the nuns. No, God bless them. I and don't roll like that. Though. We don't roll. Like, you know what I mean? If right. that was if that was where we're from and that's how we were cultured, that was our, we probably would. But you that's dropped not it like it's hot before your husband. For Teddy and for Warren. I didn't necessarily say that, but you know I got five kids. Okay. That's all I'm saying. <laughs> yeah. Point take it. Now, I'm not going to ask if Mary Mary is breaking up. I think that's a crazy question. Your sisters, it's right. Mary Mary. Right. You're not breaking up. But... Tina, your yes. sister got an offer and she wants to do some other things. Let me tell you something before How you How do you feel ask, about all of that? I'm perfectly fine with that. You know what I mean? Um, Erica, Erica likes to be a little more busy than I am. I am, even though I've got this really big kind of personality, I'm a homebody. I'm a homebody. You know what right. I mean? I love being at home with my children and my husband. And we have been going for 12 years nonstop. She don't need a bank break. I do. So I'm, I'm I'm perfectly fine with that. You know what I mean? No, you I, wanna... think, I think the break that's needed is we've been joined at the hip for 12 years. Right. You know what I mean? And I think we are two individuals that, that never get an opportunity to, to explore our individuality. When we have birthday parties for the kids or right. when we have everything, we have to coordinate everything. Yeah, everything hey, actually. I'm going on vacation. I'm going to be off. So every single thing is together. At some point in time, you go, oh. I want to give my own yes, yeah. just because I said yes, and I don't. Well, how you feel? Well, what you think? It's, it just gets a little bit much, you know what I mean? But it is who we are. It's what we've done for twelve years, and I've enjoyed it. But I think you know, we're just taking a minute to do something a little different. But Mary, Mary ain't never going nowhere. You have artists like Lecrae, yes. Artists like No Malice, who actually did a record with you guys. Uh huh. Mm. He did a remix of a, a remix, uh-huh, but yeah, he yeah. joined forces with Mary, uh-huh. Mary a while ago. How do you feel about? Uh, you know, these artists, do you see that more gospel artists are going to break into the mainstream when it comes to hip hop? I think Hmm. um, I think music continues to evolve. Every other genre is evolving and gospel is doing the same. So you have a younger group of, you know, Christian believers who, you know what I mean, don't like the necessarily old school um, sometimes their introduction to, introduction to gospel music was Mary Mary, so they're yeah. a little bit more progressive than the traditional listener. So yeah, you have some um, Christian hip hop rappers, and you know, I, most churches are in the hood, and most right. hoods have hip hop. So you always kind of have some kind of blend depending on where you're from. Like how we were raised, my father was the minister that spoke to the the gangs and the okay. you know the kids in the you know facilities and whatnot. So we were always kind of reaching out to people to the unchurched. So right. I think that's kind of why our music is the way it is and then with Warren it's it was the exact same thing his first um he, he started at death row as a producer what? yeah if um so all lies on me it was a lot of him on I did not know that Let me- what do you want your fans to take away from the show I want them to know that you don't have to be perfect for God to love you or use you that even in the face of some craziness, you can still love your family. Um, for me, the show is about our music, but it's really about our family and how me and Tina deal with each other. But at the end of the day, this is my sister, and I love her to pieces, and nobody better not step to my sister at all, or you're going to get hurt. Uh-oh. But I a mean, lot of Jesus, people don't, in, de- in Jesus', Jesus name. name, a lot of people don't defend. <laughs> I, we know people's like, oh, I haven't talked to my mom in years because we had an argument. I haven't talked to my sister yes. in years. I think it's all about family. It's about the marriages, our marriage is trying to make them work. Yeah. In, in, in entertainment and in Hollywood, marriages don't last. Tina's been married, it'll be 12 years, 12 years wow. this year and 11 years for me. So I, I'm committed to that. Yeah, 13 and then 12 for me. I'm committed to people saying that it's not easy, but it's possible. Or yes. seeing hard working mothers and women. Like it's hard maintaining a rela- relationship right. when you're sitting at the crib. Like, yeah. So it's hard doing it when you go on every week. Well, thank you for what you're doing. Oh, you're we welcome. We TV every Thursday night. God bless you all. Come back for more breakfast. It was fun. We will, yeah. Erica and Tina Campbell. Mary, <laughs> Mary. I'm Renata Romaine. It's Sirius XM 44. Air Candy with Renata Romaine. On Hip Hop Nation. Hip-hop Nation. Nation.